Hey guys, Eric Zander here, and today I'm going to show you how to untether jailbreak your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad version 6.1.6. .6. This is the latest version that a lot of different types of Apple systems allow you to update to. And just to show you that uh, I have it, it's right here under version um, that you can check in the about section. Um, so let's get started. First of all, I'll give you this link in the description to ipswhub.com. Uh, so just uh, using these menus, find the... Um, what what type of iPod you have. I have the iPod Touch 4G. I'm just going to click that. If you have an iPhone or an iPad, it's the same process. Just click that one. And um, even though we have 6.1.6, uh, .6, you're going to want to download iOS 6.0, this one right here. So download that, not 6.1.6. .6, that will not work. And it might take a couple minutes to download, but while we wait for that to finish, I'll also give you this link in the description. Uh, just click here to download it. This will be Red Snow. Um, which we're also going to need so we're just going to need these two programs and uh, it might take a while to download so I will skip the video until that's done okay so when that's done you should have two files you should have the redsnow.zip file and the iPod IPSW file uh, you're going to want to right click on the zip file and extract it here you're going to need something like winwar 7 zip to do that and if you don't know how to extract files I have a video in the description that will show you how to do that anyway uh, this folder will come out so just double click it and um, right click the extension file red snow go to properties go to compatibility and make sure that it's run in compatibility mode for XP service pack 3 and OK and then right click it and press run as administrator and then this should come up go to extras uh, select IPSW and navigate to um, the, the IPSW file that we downloaded earlier which will be right on your desktop press OK <coughs> Uh, this is OK. Press OK. Now press back and click on jailbreak. And this will come up. So when this comes up, make sure that you have um, install city checked. And you can also uh, check enable battery percentage if you want. And press next. OK, so now you're going to want to read the instructions right here to enter DFU mode, which would be pressing the power button and this button at the same time for 10 seconds. So let's do that. And wait 10 seconds and it'll turn off. And then when it turns off, wait two seconds and then let go of the power and keep holding this button right here for another 30 seconds. Just wait. And there you go. Um, it is exploiting it right now. And I let go of it and let's just watch it happen. Um, it'll take a while, so I will skip the video. Okay, so after a while, this will come up that'll say downloading jailbreak data. I don't know if you can read it right now. But that's what it says and um, just wait a little longer so when that's done all this code will appear but that's okay and on here it'll say the jailbreak for this device is currently tethered which is okay so just press okay and um, quit but keep waiting for the iPod to finish and then after a while this will come up um, you can't see it very well either but it's a pineapple and it says moving applications and just wait for that bar to finish okay, so when that's done it should uh, reboot and uh, when it does reboot, uh, you will not have Cydia yet because uh, it's been a tethered jailbreak. So what we're going to have to do is close Red Snow and open it up again like this. Uh, run. And you're going to want to go back to Extras, select IPSW again, uh, select 6.01 right there, open it up. Okay. Um, now click Just Boot. And uh, once again, we're going to do it in uh, DFU mode by pressing the power and this button at the same time for 10 seconds. And then wait two seconds and let go of the power button and keep holding this button just for a little bit. And then on the computer, it will automatically detect it in DFU mode and do some special stuff. And you can now let go of the button. And I will skip the video again until this is done. Okay, so when that's rebooted, um, go to your right, and as you can see, City has installed, so let's click on it. And um, we just have to download one more thing. Um, wait for it to load. And once it's loaded, click on Search. Um, and search for P0SIX. Um, Oh, it's right here. It's um, Poizixpin, or I don't know how to pronounce it. Just press install. 
and um, ignore temporary and uh, yeah press install or confirm sorry and um, now it's doing all this stuff to um, install it and uh, once that's done you will be untethered which means that it will always be jailbroken you don't have to be attached to your computer or anything so now it's done let's return to Cydia and um, just to show you that it's done I'm going to turn off my device just regular um, turning it off and I'm gonna unplug it from the computer so that, that it's just by itself and I will load it back up and um, I'll wait for it to reboot and then I'll come back to you and as you can see it's still unplugged but Cydia is still installed um, so yeah um, if this helps you out be sure to rate comment subscribe thanks for watching guys